what's happening everyone welcome back to the channel thank you as always for stopping on by coming on in here popping a little sunshine into your feed today uh let's go ahead and listen to some more chicago let's move on into the next track the last track on side three of uh their debut album here which is i'm a man speaking of i'm a man uh i am starting to sweat because this room is getting hot so i'm gonna go turn on the fan Drums of fame. And then we'll uh, we'll listen to the song. Matter of fact, I think I can reach from here. Hold on. Let me, let me. It's a little extra noise, but I gotta tell you, it does wonders for me. Uh, <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and get the song playing. We'll talk about it after. Let's go. I like a little bass intro.
those skins are. On the low time. That's a jam. That's that's a jam. Ooh, obviously we're gonna spend some time on that drum solo, but before we get to that drum solo, let's talk about the rest of the band and the rest of the music, huh? Love the intro. Get a little bass, solitary entry. Love that. Duh. Provides a certain groove, a little little dash of funk, just a little little light dash of funk in there, and it sets you up right. Then Danny comes in on the drums and immediately hear the difference because you hear that extra percussion begin, right? The, I don't know, woodblock maybe, some cowbell and like, you know, we're playing around with percussion. That's a great little intro. I like that. Then before you know it, the organ comes in, just, just ravaging <laughs> the scenery. And when the organ comes in and of course Terry on the guitar with the mean machine going on, you know, it's just, it's going to change the landscape of the music, right? Then... Uh, the vocals, at first you have Terry singing, which his voice is a little bit more rougher. Then you have Peter Cetera. I'm trying to memorize their names. Uh, is it Cetera? Let me make sure. Yeah, it is Peter. Okay. Um, <laughs> who has a little bit of a smoother and yet equally powerful voice. And the singing is great. Obviously, it's like, of course, blues inspired, but their own brand. Uh, the, the guitars, like I said, from Terry is just nice and heavy. The little... Uh, harmonies and the background during the music are really nice, but we got to talk about the flower on the table. We got the bouquet on the table, I should say. We got to talk about the centerpiece. We got to talk about the drum solo from Danny. I love how the music drops out and we're just left with that beat. And throughout the drum solo, he keeps that beat. He keeps his foot strong on the kit. 
Starts off very slow. Little little tumble here. Little tom there. I like how loose it sounds like the heads were on the lower tom because you can hear that big rounded sound. It wasn't a tight sound. It was like a big loose kind of round sound. So I liked that difference in the tone that you could clearly hear on the low tom uh, before we kind of moved on to the other things as we move further. But throughout the buildup of energy in that drum solo, never is that beat lost. I will tell you, this is this is the type of drum solo that I typically prefer, where it still has a groove to it, it still has movement to it, and it's it's not just like, okay, here's a show-off piece, and we're going to kind of completely kill the momentum of the music that came before. Because even if the music from before stops completely, there should still be some of that kinetic energy like still kind of going forward. You know, it shouldn't just like kill it. Sometimes it does, and that's completely fine. Sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't, like like anything else. But here, I just really appreciate the, appreciate the way that that locomotion never stopped in its motion throughout the buildup. And I love the little band call-outs that you could hear in the beginning, and then, of course, at the ending, as they uh, basically call out, hey, your time's coming to an end. <laughs> and it wasn't a powerful explosion out of the drum solo into the rest of the... The group coming back in, it was actually pretty soft, just kind of gently led by the organ. And then, of course, everybody came in, filled in their spots as expected, and fill in they did. Uh, the lyrics on this one. Well, my daddy said I'm messy about the whiskers on my chin. Never had no problems because I've always paid the rent. I've got no time for loving because my time is all used up. I spend my time creating for some groovy kinds of love. I'm a man, yes I am. I can't help but love you. So I'm a man, yes I am, and I can't help but love you. If I had my choice of matter, I'd rather be content. Being closer to the chatter, showing where your mind is at. While relating to each other how strong your love could be. Except for only sometimes groovy chicks you see. Hey, he's a man. Yes, I am. Got to keep my image while I'm standing on the floor. If I drop upon my knees, it's just to keep them on my nose. You think I'm not human and my heart is made of stone, but I've never had no problems and my body's getting strong or pretty strong. I mean, it all boils down. He, he's a man. He's doing man things. <laughs> uh, it looks like this particular track, uh, it was first recorded. Oh, so it's a cover. It was first recorded in 1967 by the Spencer Davis Group. Uh, the song was a hit, and it has been recorded, of course, successfully by Chicago, whose version charted at number 8 in the UK and 49 in the US of A. They did absolutely... I can't speak to the original, but the cover is a banger. Let me know what you guys thought, though. Comments down below. If you want, you can follow me in a few different places that are here on the screen. You can also go support the channel on Patreon for as little as $2 a month. You don't have to, blah, 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 blah. Thank you so much for being here. I hope that you enjoy the rest of your day, and I will talk to you all tomorrow, guys. Bye.